God damn, it's a bloodbath in here. Oh my fucking god. Look, look at, at look at the look at the guy over there. Got his penis. He's nailed to the wall from his penis. Oh my oh my god. I didn't know vulva could stretch that much. <laughs> look at that same thing, same nails. But now either this woman had six tits or something's wrong here. You smell that, Johnny? Oh man, I know that smell. Remember that smell from the academy? <laughs> ah yeah, the academy trained us on this smell. I know that smell well. <sighs> what is it? There's. There's been a raping in here. I can tell. I can tell. Definitely. What really gave it away was the smell, first of all, and then second of all, all of the women whose vaginas have been ripped open and destroyed from the inside out. I wonder who could do such a thing. Who such could a... do such a thing? Hey, how's it going? Uh, who, who are you? Hey, uh, no, I just came back to see the crime because, you know, like, you know, the, the whole statistic, everyone wants to see the crime, and back, oh, what are you talking about? Oh, you know, I just, I actually did, I, I did it. You really? Sorry? You, you... Excuse me? You did? Yeah, no, I, I nailed his penis up to the wall and made her watch. Okay. And then I put her vulva onto the wall second. That's with... actually sort of, that's already kind of the thing oh I had my, going here. Oh my god. And so. Sounds about right. Sounds about right. So, so what's up, what's up with the videotapes? Okay, that's the best part. So what I did is I had an F22 and I had the shutter on 46, great. And it, it created this super cool, what the fuck? It, the super cool shit. And man, oh man, I did I'm writing all this down, but I don't, I can't, listen, my so, brain ain't processing it. I don't know what so, the fuck's so, talking so about. So you're saying that you get. You get off doing this? Yeah, why else? I don't know why. Why I'm else would I why else would I do such a heinous thing? Well, at least you know you're heinous, you know? Uh, you know, you seem like not that bad of a guy. You're not that bad of a guy, you know? What what's your name? Uh my name is Derek. Derek. Wait, what what was it what was the door doing there? What was the, no one touched that. What happened there? Uh I rigged the entire house with motors. <laughs> and now oh. we're in the now we're gonna be one of the people oh. with the penises nailed to the wall. No, you don't you don't match my description, so oh. I'm gonna let you guys go. Oh. <laughs> but I'm gonna have to kill you first. Oh. I meant oh why they call it a menstruation sandwich. You know, does it make sense? Hey, everyone. Welcome back to the Collision Shack. It's us. We're in the shack. My, my seat feels really low. Is, is it now really that low? I'm noticing. Uh, but welcome to the Collision Shack. Uh, it is the Collision Shack and not a different podcast. It's not a, it's not a different podcast. With me in the studio, as, as always, um, except for that one episode where you were... Um, I couldn't think of anything funny. Travis Fletcher <laughs> and is here. And Elijah Martin is over the a- a radio waves on 107.3 oh, really now that FM. Better. Now that like, I'm taller, now that I'm taller than you, that feels more no, right. I don't I don't like that. I don't like that you're taller than me. Elijah. Remember when we were kids? No. And I was taller than you for most of our no. childhood and then you was, Yeah. I, you were taller than me? Oh yeah, point? like the whole time. How tall are you now? And and then right when you and then when we both hit puberty at around 17, you shot up 17. to be much taller than I yeah, was. So I'm I'm 5'11", basically 6 foot with, with my with my Doc Martin song. Right. With your um. fucking Eight inch stiletto hills, yeah. <laughs> hey, if you break your Those legs. Those things are fucking thick, and then dude. Fucking tells me how. Tell me how um, hard it is. Yeah, no, I, I'm like five nine, maybe five ten. I think I'm like close. You to know, five, nine, you know now. when it, it helps a lot when you're on Tinder and you put like you know five eleven. They're like, I'm basically six foot, and they're like, damn, I love a tall man. <laughs> I love a tall Elijah, man. yeah. Would you rather? Give me a would wow, you rather because sort of mine, a, my phone sort of is just, currently uh, yeah, I was about to inside say, of my pocket. So why? What do you? What are you doing there? Okay, uh, Travis. Travis, uh, would you uh, rather? Uh, yep. What's up? That one's kind of stupid. Okay. Yeah, would okay. you rather you become two sided? Two sided. So a whole other person. It's not two versions of you. It's a whole okay. other person grows in your back, and like a face connected fa- by face grows in the back of your head. Right. Ar- like so arms I'm, grow I'm out t- of your shoulders. I'm two front sided. Exactly. You're two sided. Literally. Okay. And uh, and now both people must you have to you have to fight for control of your body mm. all the time basically now. Okay. Or all right. Everything you do in life is now decided by skills check skill checks using a d twenty. Using a d twenty, right? So, so then is it permanent? Or every that time is I need permanent. To do every it. time you need to do a skill ch- a skill check, you have to roll. So and uh, and you don't get and unlike in the actual Dungeons and Dragons, you don't get any uh, any uh, what the fuck do they call it. Like special you don't get any. No, you don't get any. You don't, you don't have any points in intelligence, wisdom. You don't get any ad, ad, ad oh. modifiers. 
You don't oh, get any so, modifiers. So I'm not so. I'm not already a, an intelligence eleven. No, right. you are you are a ten down the board. No extra. Oh, no mm. extra. Anything. So, but it, it can work in my favor though, right? So I mean, it could be a d twenty is like. Well, you know. of course, yeah. Like, you, okay. Well, here's here's the thing. It could be like you're like okay. I got to make this work. You're like doing some super important thing for your job and it's like your last thing and you roll like a natural one. You're fucked. You fuck up the whole thing. Like yeah, you're fired. I'm fired. Or and then you're like, okay, I got to plug this plug into a wall. D20. <laughs> you know, it's a natural 20 rather than what I've been saying. <laughs> and then like your whole house surges with power or whatever that machine you were plugging in just explodes because so like much power. And then generates money good. because it's, you know, I mean, yeah. something, it, something good would happen because it was a natural 20. But, but I mean, thinking know, about 18 out of 20 times, I would get just a normal kind of like you know all right because even if you get a two a two is bad a two is bad but it's not a nat one you know no okay but a two you still fail like you fail outright Hmm. i mean you have a five you still fail the task you start only succeeding and depends on the task but you start only succeeding succeeding at at around 10 11 12 yeah and then well it depends on the task just like in D &D. some things you have to get past 15 to be able to succeed so so what's so what's driving like dexterity is that like a intelligence okay i think that some things you kind of like okay you're gonna roll every time you're gonna crash all the time (laughs) i gotta roll on the dashboard if i want to turn right (laughs) i think that yeah like stuff that is extremely like you have to have control i mean we're not trying to get you killed here travis come on we're not barbarians over here Uh, roll like roll for life and then roll d uh D one on in the hospital. <laughs> right, roll for life. Roll for well, life. that'd be you. You'd throw uh, saving throws. A saving throw, <laughs> but it wouldn't work because would you rather's don't work in the hospital. Or I have a oh, second whole true. person attached to my back. Yeah, that I have to fight for control constantly. Yes. And he, I'm not. He's he's not an asshole, but right. I don't. I think he's just. You guys aren't really agreeable personalities, maybe. Right. And he's so just like of, it, you know. I, I'm considering doing that because if if I let's say if you wear a hoodie. With your hood up, the back person doesn't exist. And then he has arms, and he'll just voop, take the hoodie down. Right, what the but fuck are you talking would, about? But like, does that mean my arms can bend both ways? No, dude. A new arm is gonna grow from oh. the shoulder joint. I'm t- I'm saying like he's gonna grow legs too. Oh, you're basically well, they, gonna be you're gonna be connected by the ass and back. Oh, <laughs> oh, I thought we were connected everywhere. Just like no. we have two hands. No, like I'm saying, hand you, growing you on my right grow side like a hand. person on your back. Oh. And so eventually his legs and arms will grow fully formed and we, his legs can walk just like your legs can walk. I mean, at that point, there's no front of you. you like, oh. you are just as much the back as he would so technically be. we're not attached uh, at all. I mean, we're attached physically by skin, but not by bones, organs, or nerve Some entrance. of your bones and stuff are, are, like, your whole torso is shared. Oh, okay. But, um... So, like, we share vital organs, right? Yeah, so you could... So, that is... That, so that's if, the thing. If, tri- if one of you decides they want to die and they don't like the other one, that's it. They can kill you. They stab, 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 stab themselves stab in the themselves heart. Stab themselves in the heart. And then yeah. it goes all the way through. Oh, man. Does, oh, man. So, like, what if he's, like, you know, an alcoholic and he's just drinking? Right. Like, You're hurting my liver. My liver. <laughs> or, if, like, it, or if he smokes or whatever, I get high, too. And I'd be like, he does heroin behind me. I'm like, I can feel it. I can feel that shit. Well, maybe, yeah. <laughs> That's true. So though. you're uh, so you want to become a police officer, but uh, man, you come in a positive for it's heroin, like, crack, <laughs> LSD. No, that's, that's not me, sir. No, no, no. That, that's Johnny. He turns around. Hey, I'm Johnny. Hey, I'm Johnny. I'm uh, I'm a dancer at the local male uh, club. Oh. Uh, you might have heard of me. They call me uh, Johnny Two Dicks because I have two penises. Two penises. Well, I technically have one. The other one is uh, my partner here. You, you turn back around. Hey. 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 <laughs> like, how's it going? He's like. He's like. Because uh, you, you're talking to the chief right now, obviously. The chief of the force. <laughs> Is that how you become a cop? You kind of just you go to the you, you just schedule an interview with the chief of the force, right. and then go talk to him. It's one of those things where like they put help wanted on on the the police, right? Like, like the police doors, and <laughs> do they just, also have like a closed open sign? Yeah, they do, <laughs> and then like oh no, you can't you can't report crimes. It's after you know two p.m. Uh, on a yeah, Sunday. Yeah, it's like you knock on the door. They like once someone sleeps there because they got to make sure no one yeah. breaks in. They open they're like what the fuck? It's like eleven a.m. Like oh my god, I just got stabbed. Like um go 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 go. See the sign? Are you fucking joking? It's I'm, I'm trying to sleep over here i gotta get up at 6 (laughs) a.m it's like it's like you know how like parents say like oh if you want to get a job you got to go in and talk to the manager yeah and like you gotta you gotta make eye to eye contact but in reality it doesn't actually work out that way anymore yeah and you know what they tell you to do uh why are you even here fuck off go online go online and make an application and then i'll just what they tell you and i will gamble pulling an application off the top if i need someone (laughs) gamble um but that's how the police force works right 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure how it works actually is a trial by combat, and you have to challenge an existing police officer for his position. Oh, right. And there's, so there's only ever been one position for there's, the police. Well, the no, well police. There's, there's like a set number of positions, and uh, yeah. So, so like, if they need more police officers, who do you fight? So what happens there is it has to be – so like if they went like if, – if, if the force needs five extra guys – they're going to put a six-man team against one of the police officers. Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, see, it kind of gets dirty. The police, the, the force can sponsor kind of on the down low. They can oh. sponsor different people to kind of – and so – but but here's the thing. If that one guy wins against those six, I mean, he's a god around he's the a, station now. He just he's fucking, fucking treated like royalty. He just throws a grenade in the, between them. Nah, well, okay, but the fact that he even has the grenade and the dexterity to pull it and time it right, I mean, come on. Yeah, get, he, stuff. Has, he has to cook it, you know. He has to cook it behind it. So right, right when he throws doing. it, it blows up instantly. In Have the you ever played um, uh, 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 Rainbow Six Siege? Rainbow Six Siege, <sighs> yeah. It's like those. It's, it's like that like, kind of thing. Again. It's like you just gotta, that's kind of how like what I imagine military exploits are is you kind of you get with your team and then you sort of rush a building. And then shoot a lot of other people who have lots of gadgets and gizmos yeah. that are designed to get you. That, is that kind of how it is <laughs> that's, in, that's, in the military? Yeah, that's all it is. That's all special ops are. And then, just, and then, and then, what what do they do? So they do they go sit in a room, and then if they're sitting in that room for about twenty, like fifteen to twenty seconds, then the they, room is theirs. Is yeah, that no. how it works in the military? No. So what happens is you only get twenty seconds to ch- to get all of your equipment ready, right? <laughs> and then you have about, <laughs> and then you're instantly dropped off into nowhere, into you know? nowhere, and then you you know nothing about the location or where anything is. And you just got to go use robots to find things. <laughs> right. You have to go use a little mini robot to find things. But you can only do that for a little bit. Right. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, if, if it's just a bomb situation, you can't just nuke the house and just destroy right, the bomb. Right. Because then the bomb. But... That one, <sighs> nuking the house actually sort of would. Listen, hey, they got a bomb in their garage. We got to nuke them. We got to nuke them. Elijah. Hold on. Actually, I want to I want to talk about this now. Okay. If if there was. Do we even ever choose? I would choose the the wood, the the the, uh, the, the roll the die thing. Yeah, well, I was gonna say, the roll the die thing. Yes. Oh yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. the, the would you rather the D20, yeah. the D twenty. Um, well, I was gonna, I was gonna say, if they, let's just say theor- some of the what I'm about to say here won't make any sense, but let's just say theoretically, someone they have like a bomb in their garage, right. okay, a nuclear bomb, a nuke, and they're like, okay, we have stole this from somewhere, and like it's confirmed, okay, like oh, this is a real fucking live nuclear bomb, right? They could set it off if they wanted to. Uh, and they're threatening whatever, and like we know what the blast radius is, okay, of this nuclear bomb because we know it's it's a thing, right? And so, what if it would make more sense? Let's just say for some reason, if we dropped a bomb on them, it wouldn't blow up that nuke. Let's just say that for right. some reason. Mm-hmm. Would it maybe make sense to drop off a, a nuke on that house? A, of a smaller blast radius <laughs> of just in like, order to prevent the bigger blast radius bomb from going off. So that's what happens, like, right? Because nukes don't just go off, right? They don't they don't you can't right. accidentally detonate a nuke. Right. You can you can hit a nuke with a hammer and it won't go off. Right. The only the only way that the how nukes work is that there's two pieces of uranium that it's basically it just gets shot into itself like inches above the ground. Right. If the nuke were to hit the ground before it activated, it wouldn't explode. Hmm. It has to explode uh, like above the well, ground. Yeah, that, that, you know who taught me that? Fallout Four. Fallout Four, right? Yeah. Or Fallout uh, Three, rather. Anyways, it's all schematic. You just like it just launches a, a rod of uranium into another like hole of uranium and it right. explodes and creates a fissile fission reaction and then sure, sure, sure. Uh, but yeah, you can throw a grenade at a at a nuke and it just won't do anything. It'll just go poof and then it's not work anymore. It won't be primed. Right. Okay. Yeah. So 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 could you theoretically then nuke a nuke? Yeah. I, I, I'm sure, well, maybe not nuke a nuke. Because then it would activate the uranium. Right, that's, already there. that's what I'm th- so maybe saying. I don't think that maybe a large bomb. Sure. That with the with <laughs> enough <laughs> pressure to to destroy it. God, that was so stupid. Elijah, fact or fiction? No. Uh, oh, yeah. Nukes get shot together. There's a rod that gets shot into it to explode above. I'm gonna say that's a fiction. Um, you are. You made incorrect. that up. Yeah, I made it up. Elijah, there is a tribe in the Amazon. Yes. That never cuts the umbilical cord. That like permanently. Okay, I almost thought you were about to drop on me like the tribe in the Amazon that like doesn't like uh, un- uncontacted tribes. You yeah. Know? Okay. Uh, I was gonna say, well, there's a lot of those around the world. Right. They um, don't. Ex- they don't even know we exist. No. Well, a lot of some of them do. Like there, like there's there's cases with some tribes. They know that other people exist. Like there's uh, like these other, but they just don't. They just know. interact. And they interact. don't give a fuck. There's the the most famous tribe that has been 
whatever mm-hmm. is extremely violent to other human beings. So like you try to get close and they just, and they just murder eat you, you and kill you. you. Maybe they eat you. Who knows? They probably eat their own babies too. Yeah. That's kind of, that's great. Hong Kong to tribes, right? Isn't that great? Anyway, uh, so a, a tribe in the Amazon that never cuts the umbilical cord. So yep. that doesn't make any sense. It just kind of like, it, it falls off, I guess, or it just, you know, gets detached naturally. Um, or they eat it. I don't know. It's just, they never cut it off. So, I, I forgive me if I'm wrong. The umbilical cord connects to the to placenta. The, to the placenta, and I the think. placenta comes out. And the placenta does come out. And S- so, what are you asking? And, and so you're saying this tribe they just kind of leave it there. Yeah, they don't cut it out. They just kind of leave the, the placenta just drags around them. <laughs> or that you know they they wrap it around their belt and they hook it on. So now they have right. a little pouch. The placenta right, right, right. they cut a slit in the placent, placenta and it's, it's now a pocket. A, it's now a, now bag. a packet in a bag. In a bag. Well, you're supposed to eat the placenta. The the damn I eat that dank placent. Um, I, 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 that doesn't, I mean, okay, that doesn't make any sense. It's, the, it's like, <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, but also there's, it's a, there's a possibility. Amazon tribe. That's all you got to say. I mean, they, they, they get up to some wacky stuff down there. I'm sure. I'm sure. Well, cause they, they're not governed by European standards. Yeah. And, and, and I'm sure. And that is something that wouldn't, it's not like, oh, for medical reasons, we got to I'm sure that's like some religious spiritual thing. If that's true, they sacrifice. that's what it would be. It would be like a spirit, a religious thing that they don't have to, they, do, they don't cut the umbilical like, cord. It, it, it's, or maybe they just don't know, but I mean, or, no. they're just, <clears throat> or it just falls off naturally. And they thought that's, that's the way you do it. You cut it off. Like, does it fall off naturally though? Elijah, do you cut your entire, you don't, you don't remove your nail every time it grows back. Do you just cut the ends of it? Right. They're like they're thinking like why would I cut the entire umbilical cord off? It just falls off on its own. For example, okay, that didn't really track. <laughs> what I'm saying is, does it fall off naturally? It's a part of your body. Why I don't, would it fall off? I, mean, I think it does, right? No, or no, it wouldn't technically because blood would still be rushing from it. It just won't be getting any nutrients from it like it would be. From yeah, the I, I I don't know about this. I don't know about this, Travis. Damn, I, damn. I, 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 I'll be honest. I don't know about this. <laughs> you go up to a guy. It's like, dude, nice placenta, bro. Dude, that umbilical cord is healthy, bro. They, yeah, they, your umbilical cord is looking real pink today. Oh yeah, no, it's like, like a makeup for the umbilical cord, like <laughs> less veiny and viscous, you know. <laughs> I'm with Mary Kay for umbilical cords. Yeah. Hey, would you like to join? Mary our- Kay had to set up a whole different branch of Mary Kay for it's like Mary <laughs> Kay is everything, and then. Mary Kay and Bill. Could you Cole. imagine a boss babe in an Amazon tribe? Like, what's the equivalent of a boss babe in an Amazon she's, tribe? She's trying to sell like, like, <laughs> like rocks that if that when you write on them, your stories will become famous. I don't know. I couldn't yeah, think of anything it, funny. It, God, if if you if you get one person to sell these rocks to two other people and they sell their rocks to three other people, the upline will give you more rocks to sell. For the rock monster. But then you can use those rocks you have for anything. You can skim a couple on the top, you know. You can and then only them. one of us, once a month, gets sacrificed to the rock gods. Okay, that's pretty racist, right? Is it? No. Saying I mean, that Amazon tribal people just think that rocks okay. are useful and great and stuff. Oh, like, cause see, yeah, you're right. Or are they right. so dumb that they just think they're so dumb and tribal that, oh, rock good. That's basically <laughs> what we're saying. Rock is our money. <laughs> <laughs> Why would they think that? They don't. <laughs> I guess you're right. That is extremely racist, and thank you for bringing that up. Um, uh, we're just not going to talk about it anymore. So, uh, uh, we, 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 uh, cut this bit out. Cut this bit out. Oh, is there a is there a tribe that doesn't cut the umbilical cord? Uh, no, it isn't. It no, is fiction. You would they, say, they, like, I'm really not sure, but I'm going to say you're fiction. right. It okay. is 100 percent fiction because I, I don't made it up. Gut on that. I'm one. sure that there is a tribe that does some weird shit like that. Mm-hmm. Uh, compared to our European ways, not saying it's weird, just saying it's different. Okay, just saying it's different. It's their culture. It's so whatever. And it's weird. Okay. But and it's weird. But <laughs> no. I mean, uh, but I I do have a would you rather. Sure. Pop. That pop, I would like to pop, pop, pop one. Pop it on me. Pop right. pop, pop, pop all over me. One. Would you rather sing sexy sexy back every time you talk to a female? Okay. Or sing Africa every time you talk to a black person. And sexy back. If you uh, you know I'm, I'm not I'm not a, I'm, I'm not a purveyor what? of. I'm not a purveyor of modern pop music, but I believe Sexy Back is Justin Timberlake's 2008 hit, Sexy Back. I want to bring you Sexy Back. I think it's Back. That could be what? wrong. The other brothers don't know how yeah, to I do know act. that song, though. What? It's a pretty good song. Take Except that it's not. Dirty babe. All right. Um, so would you rather sing that or sing Africa every time you talk to a black person? Come on. So you're either going to offend every black person or every woman. Or maybe the woman might think it's funny. Some women. Um. Well, here's the thing. But I feel like I not sing, every okay, black I person. Okay, I sing will. all the time. Right. 
You, you know that about me. So I could pass it off. I was like, oh, I just kind of am singing a song. No, no. I couldn't pass off Sexy Back because I wouldn't be singing that song. Well, in either either way, um, God, I don't know. See, this it's one's just... very this one's very personal for me because in middle school one time, there's a song there's oh. a song that goes like that just has like an entire chorus part part where it's like, shut up, just shut up, shut up, shut up. Yeah, like, I know that song. Yeah, and I was singing that in middle school, and I made eye contact with this kid while I was singing it on my way back. <laughs> like I just got my lunch, and like a teacher thought I was saying shut up to him a bunch of times for no reason and I got detention. You got detention? I got literal detention. She's like, "What you were saying shut up." I'm like, "No, it's a song." And I and I what I, I don't even know that guy. I was just saying like <laughs> singing the song. I don't even know loud. that guy. And but yeah, she's like, "Hey, what are you what are you doing?" I'm like, "Oh, what the fuck?" Middle school Travis for me is like it, I mean, I know I did that's I know what, you that, in middle school? Uh, yeah, I did. That's Probably what I grade. that that it made me hate authority every day after that. <laughs> <laughs> hate authority. That's where your deep-seated hatred of authority comes from, right? Exactly, yeah. Um, but, you know, middle school Travis is – what how I imagine him is sort of like how TV shows sometimes handle in a tongue-in-cheek way, like actors doing past bits by just having the old – the actor just yeah. be old in the in the past memory. Right. That's how I imagine you. It's just kind of you, but maybe shorter. I mean, it's like scaled down. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's like how John Mulaney portrays himself as a, chi- a kid, uh, you know, like – Huh. Like it's super hyper intelligent. Like he knows everything <laughs> as as a, everything he knows now. He knows as a kid. That's how I kind of see. Yeah, you. that's that. But that's that's me not knowing why the world is punishing me <laughs> from. Uh, and I had, to, I had I had to sit alone well, and a, eat my lunch. It's a terrible it was, song. It, it, it well it is, but it was fucking stuck in my head because of my you know. Is it possible that that teacher or whoever the wait. Yeah, okay. Is it possible that that teacher just hated that song? And was like, oh my fucking God. Again okay. with this shit? Detention. Detention on and you. And I'm like, what? I wasn't even saying it to him. That's not the fucking point. And you're like saying it to uh, Yeah, yeah, you were. <laughs> like, She's like, oh God, thank God. <laughs> thank God that there was a reason maybe. Uh, <laughs> what were we talking about? No, I'd rather do the Africa like, one. Really? Yeah. So like, if like... If because everyone loves that song and I could totally spin can, it in can, a non-racist way. Okay. Uh, I'm at the... I think of something. Uh, I am working at a Taco Bell. Oh, okay, okay. And so, so I am what a are black you, what man. are you saying here? So like like every time I talk to them I have to sing that first? Yeah, when you talk to a black person. No. <laughs> okay, it's so sort of... I, I like the idea of uh of you singing it every time you're not talking to him. Okay, so like, so, so, so we you can walk just have up a conversation but I kind of have to sing. It. That is how I act pretty much in my day to day Okay, though. so so the, let's let's emulate a conversation. I'll I'll be the black African American person. Okay. And take this charge. Don't take this charge lightly. Okay. Okay, <laughs> um, the, I'm at Taco Bell serving you. Uh, okay, t- uh, whatever. And I'm, I'm like, I'm like, you come so, in. So you're, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm ordering from you. Yeah, okay. I'm like, hey, how's it going? Um, let me, let me, I'm, I'm coming. Let me open, do the whole Foley work. Okay. Open the door. Hey, oh, going? hey, what's up? What's up going on? What would you? Um, like? okay, oh, God, the menu is just looking so good today. Um, <laughs> so what would you like to have right now? Um, so I think what I'm gonna go for is definitely give me the uh, taco. The no, nope, that's not what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say the nachos bel grande. Uh, the no, no, would, t- no tomato on that. Okay. Would you like the t- uh, the extra tomato oh, fuck, on I that, forgot, I see or uh, would tomato you like the extra tonight. numbers two? We can get that a combo. What are you? Like, what are you? Sorry, what are you saying? Something? What was that? No, you're. Uh, but, so you? Oh, excuse me. Are you seeing Africa? I am. Don't you Barbara, love, don't you love Barbara, that? Get over don't here. you love that this song? This racist, racist ass <laughs> so, motherfucker. Okay, so there's a bit. So okay, I, let's let's debrief this bit. So now that we've kind of seen how you think so someone might react to me singing Africa from them, we can sort of deduce why you thought this would be a problem. Right. Yeah. Everyone loves that song. No one's gonna think I'm like a black guy isn't gonna. Okay. No, here's no, no, the no. Situation. Barbara's white. Exactly. Here's and the then situation. Barbara's gonna come I'm over. talking to a white guy. And I'm just like, oh yeah, can I get the number seven? And he's like ringing me up. Okay, and then the, he's like, "Oh, sorry, I gotta go take care of this in the back." My friend, you know, Dave's gonna help you. And then Dave comes up. He's black, and then I'm like, "Oh shit!" <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! And bless the rain. And how can I help? And you? like Dave was sitting there the whole time because he was he, he, he was kind of just on the he was other cleaning register, up a mess yeah. on the counter. Yeah. And uh, so he was there. He heard me not singing it. But now that I'm talking to him, I'm singing it every time I'm not speaking. <laughs> That's basically the only situation. Yeah. Well, I mean, but anytime. Oh, here's okay. The, now, what no, about, here's, okay, let's here's say, the problem with sexy back. Why it's much worse. Okay. Because. Even if, like, if she thinks I'm being sexist, I guess, it doesn't matter. Like, even if that doesn't even cross her mind, it's just fucking stupid. And it's going to make me look like an asshole idiot. I'm bringing sexy back. Exactly. And I'll have a number three. All the other brothers don't know. And can you add tomatoes, too? Like, exactly. Exactly. That sounds so bad. Much worse than, than singing, you know. 
Toto's I think, hit Africa. But imagine, let's say, let's say you're in a fight, right? You, you, you shoulder bump this guy, and he's like, "Hey, what's going on?" And you're like, "Oh, the I rain down in Africa!" Down in Africa. <laughs> and you start screaming, and it's just like you can see the rain. Now, what really. if, what if? Okay, <laughs> now imagine this. Now, okay, now, is it only? Is it every time I talk to a black person, or is it every time I see a? Anytime black person? you make eye contact or like interact uh, visually, Vis- okay, with because here's person. what I was thinking: I'm masturbating to a porn. Okay, <laughs> and let's just say for some reason I I went really quickly, so it's like uh, in the beginningish part of the porn. Right. And what happens in this porn is there's a third member that comes halfway through, catches them, and then joins in. Right. Okay. The and that guy's plot. black, and so as I'm about to finish, I see him, and he looks right at the camera, and I look at him, and I'm like. Oh, I bless the rays. Da, da, da. <laughs> that, was, you, that, that was the whole joke. I, I'm, I'm, I, I come all over the place while while singing, while belting out the chorus to Africa. Or anytime you watch, <laughs> uh, you know, like POV porn, you'd have to sing "I'm Bringing Sexy Back." Uh, right. While you, okay. Because like, like, like you know, it's like, oh my God, step bro, what are you can, doing? You can, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's I, who did I say that to? I said that a couple of days ago. I was like, I think maybe it was someone on the mic when we were playing games. I was like, so do you just, is it like, do you prefer step, step uh, mom porn or just full on mom just porn? Just full on mom porn. Do you, I, I like it's the, like, okay, you can't go into a porn website without seeing shit like that. Like on it's the front page. It's fucking rampant. It it's is everywhere. Ra- it's everywhere. Yeah. And, and if you look at statistics, like have you seen the state maps of like US, there are states in the US, many states in the US where like stepsister or stepmom is right. the highest search term on Pornhub. Honestly, well, it, it's 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 making. I guess, is it ever has it ever been what anywhere? Is, well, okay, I've heard. People, is it making a comeback? I, I've heard people explain it. What's the deal with that? Uh, someone on Reddit, I remember they were making a joke about it, and then someone was like, "Yeah, but I actually kind of actually watch it because it's f- it's fucking super fake." One, right? Uh, they're all. I mean, I guess that's probably real, but you know, it's all these all the mass produced ones are all super fake, right? Okay, and typically he would basically broke down that. Because of the nicheness of the genre, there's like certain points it hits that most other, other porns or whatever that he watches doesn't hit them. But like it's just the right stuff. Is it, is it like it the, has nothing to do with the fact that they're supposed to be siblings? Is, is it because they're it, not? Is it is it sort of kind of like uh, or, like or, the environments or related? I guess like or like the situations that like, yeah sex exactly might happen. yeah exactly it's about because it's about normal porn is like hey you got a pipe you need to be fixed you're like oh that's not that's not even close to being realistic but being, yeah being at a, at home it's like you know thunder outside you know I think it's, it's just like, touching yeah I think it's just touching the fetish the fetish just leaf. because you know. Everyone, you know, fetish fetishisms are specific, and then you know about you know like people have specific right. fetishes. Mm-hmm. But uh, typically, it's like you either don't really have any fetishes, or if you have a fetish, you're gonna have a bunch of fetishes. <laughs> so it's either someone has opened up th- themselves sexually to exactly. all fetishes, <laughs> exactly. or you're just well, super fetish. vanilla. I mean, I like I like butt play sometimes, but not inside the butt, just only outside of the butt. I like butt or, cheek uh, play. Uh, but <laughs> I, I like to I like to have sex with a vagina, but not I don't like to insert my penis into it. I just like to rub it on it. Sort of rub around it. Rub around um, it. Yeah, I'm gonna do the black one. All right. Okay. Oh, wow, that is uh, super loud. Great, um, Elijah. Would you like to sell some khakis always? I would love to sell some khakis always. That's S S K A. Sell some. Sisca? Sell khakis always. Siska. So, no, it's it's. Would you like to sell? Then the acronym begins. Some khakis always. Now it is called Ska Loop. Right. It's, well, no, it's well. It, that's what it was, it was called. It was yeah. called selling khakis. Always love our ovulation periods. Periods. Nice. That, nice. That's, that, there it is. Selling khakis. Always love our ovulation periods. Love, love our ovulation periods. Elijah, you have to combine three items. You know that actually kind of works in two ways because it's like period because like ovulation and periods are kind of but ovulation do happen related. as often. But as also. Periods. Uh, but you could also be talking about ovulation periods, like the period of time that yes. you're ovulating. Mm, yes. Double entendre. Is ovulation like a word for like like circular as well? Or does it just mean no. ovulating? You're thinking like oval? <laughs> like oh, ovulation. O- ovulation. <laughs> it's like, ov- well, one ov- makes something oval. <laughs> the earth ovulates around the, around the, 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 the sun <laughs> once a year. It ovulates. Oh, my God. All right. The three items you have to combine, Elijah, are as follows. A ring, a CD... And a thermostat. Done. Thermostat. Where are you? Done. Where are you? Done. Where are you? I'm done. Uh, where are you? I'm. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm looking for um, a ring for my my soon to be wife. Okay. That I really wanna really wanna dig down, bury deep, come inside of her kind of thing, kind of wife. Okay. Where I wanna have kids, plenty of them, all of them. None sure. Of, we haven't been using condoms the entire time, so sure. it's kind of like just normal. I can't, I don't know why I always do this. What the fuck is the third item? It's a ring and a thermostat. In a CD. A CD. Okay. You can't remember the third one. 
All right, I, I'm just uh, I, I'm just, I just walk in. And so, so walk in I'll, where? Where are into, you? Into, into really the, the the K Jewelers. Okay, so I'm a K Jeweler employee. Well, I mean, the, are you? Yes. Okay. All right. So maybe. I, well, me... okay. Let's just say that that's what you think when you walk in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and whether I actually am or not is up to. So it so I, I'm gonna do the sound effects. Oh hey, what's up? Uh, hey, what's going on? Um, so uh, I'm looking for a ring. Oh, I have that is ex- the exact description of a ring we're trying to move right now. Actually, let me go get it from the back. Yeah, sure. And I like that one. Ooh, that twenty thousand. They did say three months pay, right? Uh, hey, where's the guy that sells the ring? Uh, yeah, no, he just went in the back. He's he's gonna sell me. Well, okay, <laughs> I hopped up the counter. Oh hey, uh, let's just see. Are you just gonna you just gonna take that ring? No, I'm selling to you. Are you you're which ring do you want? You're not wearing like all the same clothes. Which ring other. do you want? Uh, hey, hey, can you come back? Yeah, I'll just be one second. I'm looking for it. I, I, it's a fucking mess back here. Uh, I don't know who the fuck the night shift people are. Oh, They're shit. supposed to fix it. It's a fucking wreck back here. I don't know why. Well, there's like there's uh, a guy. Hey, listen, I'm getting to it. I'm looking for it. Uh, all right. Okay, all right. Uh, okay. uh, dude, this one, and I jam the ring on your finger. <laughs> it's like not the right size. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's not even nearly the right size. Look, if you look at that, it tells you the temperature it is outside. Uh, it's not even on the right finger. And Isn't it's it beautiful? Small. Yeah, it's it's really beautiful. It tells you what temperature it is outside. Uh, what temperature? It is 69 in here. Wow, that is kind of nice. cold. It's like nice. 103 outside. Nice. I don't know how they... Goof. He, he fucking... Well, hold on. Goof. Clears all the rings and shit that it are on the table. It just falls off. Goof. Puts down a CD player. <laughs> Click. Oh, hey, what's going on here? Oh, nothing. Get here. out! Oh. Get the hell out of here! I'm doing a sale! <laughs> Sorry about that. Jesus fucking Christ. That was my brother. Oh my God. Is your brother? Your yeah, brother? I don't know. You're Maybe. Just waiting. You don't know. Uh, okay, give me the ring. <laughs> I think I degloved your feet. <laughs> <laughs> your, your skin came off with that. And I and I just take the ring, and you think this is a crazy person. Nothing's going to happen. I just kind of shove it in the CD player and jam it closed. All right. Click. And bless the rains down in I fucking Africa. love this song. How could anyone hate this song? I know. It, it's not a good song. That's it good. Is, Even a... I'm crazy. I would not think it's a good song. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh, how much? Uh, uh, well, I mean, usually it's like, what, three months uh, salary? So uh, yeah, three years salary. Uh, three months salary is usually. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, um, you, got a, you got a little on your, on your lip. You got oh, a little... yeah. Okay. Yep. Now accomplish something. Well, I'm surprised that was so like viscous. Uh, it was, it was, it's really <laughs> kind of dripping. Like flubber. On shirt. Like it's it's like it's like <coughs> the slime you make. You know, it's just like comes off of your face. All right. Yeah. Um. So so what you're saying is that how much for that? I, I don't. Aren't you the one? Si- hey. Hey, are you gonna come out? Yeah. Here? I think I found it. I'm just polishing it up. I'm just polishing it up for you. Listen. I can't find the polisher anywhere. It's a fucking mess back here. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, okay. How much? Uh, like, okay. So uh, give me one. One seventy-five, man. One one seventy-five. One seventy-five, man. One dollar and seventy-five cents. One dollar seventy-five cents. Do you think my wife will like this? This is a picture of her. Oh my! Wa- oh, she'll hate it. But uh, if uh, but she'll like the song, I think. So it'll be fine. Right. What, what's the song? Uh, I can just click black. Is it because she's black? Uh, Is she because she's black? Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm I don't even want to buy this no, anymore. No, it's fine. I, uh, oh, I'll buy if it's one dollar. I'll see you one dollar and raise you to two fifty. Two. That was more than what you first sold it to me. No, I said three seventy five first. You, okay, deal. <laughs> God Make damn him lies. It. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, sure, yeah, well, sure. Why that not? is honestly not where I saw that going. <laughs> yeah, no, not at all. I I wanted that character that I ended up selling it to to come in and like just kind of tear shit up, and then when I came back out, it was just sort of t- all everything was torn up. It's just, but you never kind of went different. I, I tried to get him. To come <laughs> all right, Elijah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna refresh that the deedle bop. Okay. I, I also thought it was <laughs> the concept of the employee. Like it's a fucking mess back here. I don't know what the fuck's going on. <laughs> the night crew. Uh, not taking care of their business. <laughs> they did not do the cleaning procedures. I have no idea why it's so. There's just diamond flakes everywhere. Diamond flakes. Oh my god. So, so the three items I'm gonna have to sell to you. Oh, it's on a loop. Nope. Wow. Um, hey. is a hairbrush. Hey, 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 hey. They don't call it selling khakis. Always love our ovulation. Period. Uh, period. Forever. For nothing. Yep. Yeah. Is a hairbrush a drawer? Okay. Not not a dresser, but a drawer just from a dresser. Drawer from a dresser. Yeah, and a cinder block. Jesus Christ! Okay. <laughs> this one's gonna be interesting. All right, all right. Where, where are you? Okay, at? Uh, okay. So I think. Um, let me think. Let me think. Let me think. 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 Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. 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 Let me think. You were thinking. You were thinking. Okay, that's copyright. I 
think, 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 think. Uh, the melody is probably not. I'm sure it's so yeah, old. I'm it's sure out of copyright. It's, it's way old. Fucking late 1800s, I'm pretty sure, is when that one came out. It is yeah. Russian, though. Isn't that crazy? <sighs> um, okay, Those Russian so bastards. It's because we associate it with, like, cowboy shit, but it's like... It had nothing to do with Cowboys when it was written. Silent film, probably, is where it came from. Probably. Mm. Okay, so I think I am a... Uh, I'm, I'm running a lemonade stand outside of, like, a Country Time lemonade factory. Like, and I'm and I'm using, like, my home-brewed lemonade schnicks. And I'm, like, telling everyone who's going in, like, I, it's better. I, I got the better stuff right here. Right. Anyway, so that's kind of what I'm doing. So I'm just selling lemonade. It's, and it's like a crude... Crudely, crude wooden sign that I nailed to like, and it says lemonade like ease, ease backwards. sort of backwards, yeah. yeah. And then it's like five cents, yeah. And at this point, like, I think people were more sad for me than anything because they realized like five cents he could. Well, first of all, he picked a very bad location, but second of all, <laughs> he's a grown man selling lemonade for five cents. But uh, you know, okay, that's what I'm doing. All right, and and I'm just walking by, going yeah. into the lemonade factory, right? Um, uh, here, take this. Try it. It's the same guy. It, no, <laughs> just like. Oh. I'm bringing in sexy back. Oh. <laughs> uh, hey, what's going on? Uh, what's going on, little little kid? Oh, what's going on, little kid? And, I, then, I, and then I rise up. I'm like, <laughs> oh, I just, I, I, my eyes like. Would you like a cup of lemonade? Um, for, oh, how, I have, how much? Is I have it? here delicious lemonade for you. Oh, um, this lemonade? Oh, only five cents. Oh, um, I could just go to work and just get a free glass of lemonade. Could you? I, because yeah. you know it's funny. You know I've uh, I've asked so many people coming in and out of here. You know going to work. I've asked so many people. Hey, would you like a cup of lemonade? A refreshing cup of ice cold lemonade? And you know what they uh, say to me? Nothing. Sometimes. Sometimes. Do, do, has any of them mentioned the fact that you don't have a cash drawer? Um. <laughs> you know they haven't because I do. Oh really? It, it, I, it's right here. Oh, as, it's right you, there? as you can see. Let me see. Let, can I see it? Mm, <laughs> no. Okay. I also have. Oh, I, <laughs> oh my God! It's going around. Do you, the, do you want your fucking cash drawer back? I don't. I could just. Okay, sure, sure. Uh, by the way, I, you're go, you're gonna be arrested. I'm an undercover cop. Oh I really? Pull all my oh, shit God. off. Oh god! And I fucking and <laughs> you, you start running away. I throw my 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 rubber extendo. Uh, <laughs> go 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 you. go go. Uh, arm. And no, I've never done this before. But I, I chuck my handcuffs at you. I'm just please, please, and it pff, I'm binds up, you I'm up. up. <laughs> And I fall down. I'm like, ah, you're never getting me away. And, and I then, start and running. Then I, and then I, well, I come and I tie up your legs. Oh. Okay. I, I'm right in front of you. And okay. then I, I kind of crash down from you. I'm like, see, boy. And then, the, and then as it flies past, a gust of wind kind of blows my hair everywhere. And I'm like, oh, and I put my hair back. I'm like, oh, my God. Ah, this hair, this hair is always getting in my way. God. If, if only there was something I could do to tame this. It's so messy and tangled up. Hey, I can hey, never. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, listen to me. I, I what, have, what's up? I have, what's up, criminal? I'm not a criminal. I have, I have the perfect thing. <laughs> For you, I write. Okay, it's a it's a hairbrush. I know you have a problem. A hair? What'd you call a hair? A hair? What? A hairbrush. All right. Hey, the the cash box is over there, by the way. Oh, nice. It has like some feathers on it. Hit a couple. This birds is actually where way. I keep all. I, you really scared me when I did this because of the secret compartment. My gun. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. Oh, that's so crazy. Um, so I have this like uh, hairbrush, and noticing that you know your cash drawer my is hair's, all fucked up. My hair is ever. Yeah. So I, this I cash have, drawer is pretty fucked. I have this like. Ugh. <laughs> It's a it's a drawer. <laughs> we don't, I don't need block. the cash drawer though. I'm thinking because I'm actually an undercover cop and not a lemonade salesman. But you were selling lemonade. Wait, wait. Do you have a permit to sell lemonade? Oh my god! <laughs> I rip off my my jacket. I'm the police officer. <laughs> You're an undercover the guy. undercover. Oh my god. Business, uh, Better Business Bureau. And then I take uh, off my uh, uniform. I'm an undercover criminal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, hey! And then I, I so start, I start booking it. Obviously, uh, and I'm know. hopping after you. And then yeah. I I throw my cinder block at your head. It goes. Right, C killed. I'm Inst instantly dead. <laughs> instantly instantly dead. you kill me. Uh, my head is obliterated. And then I uh, go in your back pocket, take a uh, forty two cents. Bills, no, I, bills I take out. I take like ten cents because that's literally all you oh, had. I had. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Two people bought lemonade, and then uh, and then I walk away. Uh, I hop away because I'm still like hogtied. Sure. Um, and I'm gonna I'm gonna count that one as a win. Mm. I'm gonna be honest. That, that was one, a win. That, that one's win. definitely a win. Listen, you left my corporal form with the product, and you and you left the place with money. That's a sale. That. If that isn't a sale, I don't. I don't know, know what the fuck is. I don't, I don't know what the fuck. That's seriously. how I've been selling, you know, my multi-level marketing juices. Yeah. For uh, ever, um, in general. Um, what the fuck is that? I don't. Oh, you know what? Ah. Uh, mm. You know, this is, you when know, they you... when they said that this club was uh, popping, I w didn't expect. It's very slow. It's very music, very you know? slow. 
And you know what I'm noticing now about the people? Remember when we came in, we're like, those people are dancing extremely weird on the dance floor. Okay. Wait, hold on. Yeah. Everyone's staring at us. Yeah. Yeah, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, huh? Yeah, maybe maybe we should have wore togas to this to this thing. To this toga party? Yeah, everyone's wearing like super. Okay, old... they're approaching. They're pro- Every... I, I yeah, got listen, guys, guys. Hey, listen. hey. We 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 don't, we, don't, we, don't, we don't, Oh my god. Oh, we're, guys, what are you? Where are you taking us? Where are you taking us? Please, where? please, I have a. They, they, we they awake, take, we they awake with we awake with togas. <laughs> <laughs> they, they take our uh, they take our uh, our bags over our heads. <laughs> oh, oh, what's happening? Uh, I can't I can't see anything. It's so dark in here. Oh oh hey sorry sorry. Uh, can you see now? Can you see? Yeah now? yeah. Oh okay. we're in the same. You didn't even move us. We're no, in the exact same no, place. No it's it's a whole joke thing. We we like to do it. Would you like a drink? We we welcome all of our new guests that way. We make them feel really uncomfortable, okay. and then they come and join. Sure. Let's uh. So let's 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 pump this up with a with a little bit of better better music. You know. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Oh, now this is much more my speed. Yeah. This is this is the non. Can you crank, crank that up a little yeah. bit? The, the, hey Johnny, turn up. Turn it up. It's a live band. Yeah. They, they just need to turn up the. Amps. Yeah, they just turn up. They have a master volume. That they just turn it up. <laughs> kind of crank up. Yeah. Oh, man, I, I, the hospitality in this place. I mean, initially I was kind of scared. I think I was scared. Were, you know what happened? You know what it was when all the people approached us and looked like they wanted to get us. I, that was scary. That that was scary. Well, and then uh, that's what we try to do here at uh, here at Johnny's Johnny's uh, Hit and Run um, Parlor. Uh, hit and Run we, Parlor. We we hit and we run and uh, that's what <laughs> this we bit's do. falling apart. Yeah, I'm fucking, I don't even know what's happening anymore. Elijah, would you like to give me a would you rather? Yeah. Yeah, sure, I got one for you. Hey, drivers, would you rather? Yeah. What's, idiot. <laughs> was that supposed to be like a slight at me? Idiot. You dumb, <laughs> dumb idiot. Okay, so you either have to melt down into a bucket for 24 hours every week. And yes, I got the inspiration from Star Trek Deep Space Nine, if anyone was wondering. Hmm, all right. It's just relax. Like that's how uh, no relax. no yeah you have to reform like, yeah. like 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 if you don't do that you will get all fatigued and you'll right. probably die I guess right I don't know. that was also a bit inside of uh, the Orville have you seen that show they pro- that's a, I yeah. mean it's a Star Trek okay comedy show so I didn't realize I'm sh- that I'm, I, yeah. I now understand why yeah where they really got it there's a character on Star Trek Deep Space Nine who's like a shapeshifter and he has to like melt down into a bucket like for twelve hours some, or not that's 12 how hours, he sleeps but every night yeah they, I think that is kind of how it is I don't remember exactly. But uh, anyway, so you have to either melt down to a bucket for 24 hours every week. Okay. So a whole day out of your week, which is one-seventh of your whole life. Okay. When you really think about it, I wanted to break down the numbers for you. Or you lose your hands and feet. And that's just it. You just don't have any hands or feet. I just have, like, arms with no hands. yep. And then arms with no feet. And I could have prosthetics if my insurance covers it, but let's be real. Yeah. My insurance probably covers cover covers a medical uh, bucket than it than it does a fake hands and feet. Exactly. Feet. So <laughs> medical bucket. Uh, so uh, I'm just gonna I'm gonna go with the meltdown because like like could I melt anywhere or does it have to be in a bucket? Well, I guess it doesn't. You so, could melt so, anywhere. So so what if I what if, me- if you literally turn into a liquid? What if so I melt if down and melt- someone scoops me a part of me out and then I reform? Will I be missing like an arm? Yes. Or something, or, yes. or a vital organ. <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, I don't remember how they handled that in the show, or even if they do. But I yes. think they should have explored that options because that would have been a. Listen, great we're not platform. Star Trek over here, okay? Okay. We're right, on right, uh, sci-fi right, production. Uh, all right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do the bucket. What would you do? I'd probably do the bucket. <laughs> I know it's terrible. It's obvious. It's obvious. It's terrible. But I mean, but, okay. Actually, still, really think about it. Really think about okay. your your precious I'm really time on this earth. How, how, right, how often? How many hours? 24 hours. So I have to lose a day. For a 24 day. hour stretch every week. So I have to like request off work. I'd be like, hey, I can't work yeah. Tuesdays. No, you're working Tuesdays. That's a holiday. Like, no, literally, I cannot work. <laughs> I, 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 I will have, be goo. I will be goo. Oh, yeah. What is it because you're drinking all Monday night? No. <sighs> because I need to turn into a fucking bucket of liquid. All right. Whoa. Hey, hey. And I'm going to report you to the Disability Act. People, because the, you just discriminate the disability again. act. People, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, and uh, this is this is unfair. All right, I think. Um, do I have to be refrigerated during no, this time? No, and I, but I think you do have to go into a, a bucket because, like, if you just like where or else would a you container. go? A container of some sort it doesn't have to be a bucket. I right. mean, that, that wasn't the that's the most important part. The bucket, the bucket. <laughs> it has to be a stainless steel non. Uh, uh, what's happening out there? Oh shit! I made it. I, Okay. It. Uh, what, what, Elijah? Well, I, I would do the bucket. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Me too. I would do the bucket. And you know what, Elijah? Also, I would do. Is I, I would, would do both. Actually, I would. Uh, I would do the wrap up. <laughs> <laughs>
because it's it's oh, okay. forty it's forty five minutes of the podcast. Thank Good. you everyone for watching. We should go fucking or listening. We can go swim out there. Yeah, with your it dog. Like, it's like the perfect day to swim. It is the perfect day to swim. And what you should do today on this what's perfect today? day to swim on the eighteenth of June, you should go and swim and hang out. But before you do that. Thank you for listening. Yeah, I was going to say, do you not know the first, very uh, first thing I do? Uh, what you should do is uh, thank yourselves for listening to us. And you should go after that. You could follow us on any social media. You can go to at Travis Fletcher if you want to go follow me. Or at Elijah Joseph Martin. That's Joseph with an F uh, on Twitter. He doesn't post anything. Or you can follow us on any social media at Collision Shack on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram. And uh, you can just uh, go ahead and do that. And if you have a would you rather you'd like to submit, you can also... Submit it to collisionshack.com forward slash message, or you can direct message us on so any social media. Instagram. Very true. Very true. You can go to uh, Twitter. Yep. You can even submit it directly to us at Charles Fletcher at Elijah Joseph Martin. That's Joseph with the math. Yes. Um, you can also rate our podcast on iTunes, or you can rate us on uh, collisionshack.com forward slash rate if you don't have that option available <laughs> to you. Very true. Um, or you could just go on our Twitter and be like, hey, dude, listen to this shit and just share our Super posts. True. We do uh, highlights every, that would help every us. week. That helps a lot. Um, also, if you would like to give us a dollar a month, you can also join our Patreon, and you can get a video version of this podcast, which I'm staring at the camera right now, which the audio listeners can't do that. You also get an after show called The Collision Corner, where we just bullshit. We take off our pants. We show our buttholes a little bit. A little bit. I don't know. We kind of just do whatever we want. You can ask us personal questions, bit. and uh, it's, it's just for you. And uh, you, uh, you'll you get a shout-out as well. And, of course, most important but not least – and not, but it's the last. It is last. Uh, <laughs> it is absolutely uh, last. It's absolutely last. Is I would like to de- de- like to thank Dave Shunka and the Screaming Eagles for his use of our th- uh, his song and our theme. Song. Our use of his theme song. Our use of his song as our theme song. Our use. Because it's not a theme song. Uh, we yeah, use it as a theme right. song. Right. For the oh, for the use of, the use of our theme song. The use of our theme song. Do 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 do. <laughs> Man, it is such a bopper. You're gonna hear the it's ending part good. of that song. It, I would say go download it on. You got them all. <laughs> and you got yeah. them all in order, too. Did I really? Yes, you oh, did. That's why yeah. when you said Patreon, I was like, fuck yeah, I did it. <laughs> did it. I couldn't believe it. Fuck yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Woo. Damn. Woo. Damn, that was a good one. Woo. Um, that was a good one. Uh, good job. Course, I, I, let uh, you, I really let you take the lead on that one. Yeah, I was, I was struggling there for a second. I thought I, was, I, thought I wasn't going to make it. Um, yep. If you're a Patreon, uh, stay. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Yep. See ya. Yep, see ya. Well, that's what I thought you were going to say. Yep. See ya. <laughs> okay. Yep. All right. Elijah, shake my hand. Shake my hand, buddy. Oh, yeah. Mm, so delicious. Delicious.